being a huge fan of Daphne du Maurier, she's my favourite novelist, and also being a big fan of horror, I was very excited to see The Birds for the first time. And I have actually seen this a few times now. And I have to say, while I think it's maybe put on a bit too much of a pedestal, I still think it's absolutely fantastic and, and absolutely worth a watch. So the film adaptation was released in 1963, directed by Alfred Hitchcock, and based on the short story by Daphne du Maurier with a screenplay from Evan Hunter. And this stars Rod Taylor, Jessica Tandy and Suzanne Plachette, and also Veronica Cartwright, who seems to be in a lot of films that I've watched recently for some reason. And this, as you would suggest, as you would imagine, is about birds. And I'll read the description from IMDb, which will give you a little bit more information. This says... A wealthy San Francisco socialite pursues a potential boyfriend to a small northern California town that slowly takes a turn for the bizarre when birds of all kind suddenly begin to attack people. I'm terrified of birds. I really am very scared of birds. So I'm not particularly going to like a film about birds unless it's a horror because it will scare me. And this absolutely did. The fact that it's black and white kind of just makes it all the more eerie for some reason because... I feel like black and white horror always has an element of the unknown and that works very well here. So the narrative itself, I I wasn't really taken with. Even with de Maurier's book, with the characters, their, their personal lives, things they're getting up to, their, you know, their aspirations, I don't really care. I never really felt connected with any of the characters. I wasn't really bothered about their potential relationships. The interesting parts start when the birds make an appearance and they make a slow appearance and then they become more and more and more of them and as this increases, so does the fear factor and it does get quite intense and quite intimidating pretty quickly. So although I wasn't that bothered about the, I guess, the bare bones of the narrative, the foundation blocks of the narrative, it does get to the horror aspect pretty quickly, but not in a way that it's in your face. It does have a slow build-up but we get to the point more quickly than I'm currently getting to the point, at the very least. And when we first meet the birds, they're a little scary, but they're obviously not the most terrifying things ever. By, you know, halfway through, it's just really quite sinister. And if you're like me, you're not a fan of birds and you're really uncomfortable around birds, it's something that's going to really get to you, I think. It's done so fantastically well that you will not look at a flock of birds in the same waves. What are they thinking? What are they looking at us for? Are they going to attack? Are they going to get us? What are they going to do with that sharp beak? That can do a lot of damage very quickly. It's eerie. The music also plays a very strong part in making it quite sinister. In terms of the acting, it's very good. We have a lot of um, very panicked scenes and... I feel like that works particularly well, especially with Jessica Tandy. It very involved. This is not something I've seen in the cinema, partly because I was not born in the 60s and partly because I've never had the opportunity. But I would quite like to. I'd like that involved group experience. I think it would really heighten how dramatic it is. It's quite a long film, nearly two hours. I don't think it needed to be that long, particularly as this is adapted from a short story. There are some liberties, but... It's not really a problem. It is terrifying. Not the scariest film ever, but the subject matter makes it really eerie. I do not like birds, but I like the film The Birds. It was Oscar nominated for the best effects. Um, it didn't win, unfortunately, but that doesn't matter. It is still very entertaining, absolutely worth watching. If you like horror, I think you'll really like this. If you hate birds but like to be scared... I think the birds will be perfect and I don't know what de Maurier thought of this but I'd like to think that it's one that she really liked and I really need to look more into that actually because I, I, I value her opinion a lot and I hope she liked it. Personally, I thought it was pretty good.